We coming. All right, uh, last Woo. segment, and this is it until what? August, late August, Man, end of summer. I know y'all gonna miss us. Um, we need the rest. We gonna miss y'all too. Um, hopefully you've enjoyed your time with us this second season. Of course, this last finale, this season finale. Um, and we want to come to you too. We want to come to your spot. We want to come to your school with an honorarium. <laughs> Do not yes. forget it. Finance. Um, no romance. And whatever. my check is coming when. Just hold on. No, no, no. Hold on. Oh, oh, oh. symbiotic. Yeah, but oh, we did. Oh, yeah, 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 <laughs> uh, <All right>. <laughs> we, can, we can really get ready to close out because it's been, you know, I'm, I think we exhausted with this topic. Yeah. I think hopefully everybody enjoyed it, oh, man. Fatigue. What's yeah. up? What, what we got some shouts out for everybody that, that came in season two because we had some uh, some great guests. Yeah, man, wonderful guests. So anybody who was on the hip hop panel, we did a panel full of poets. Yeah. Shout out to all of them. Yeah. Hype Life and uh, uh, Live C. Shout mm. out to uh, the hip hop panel. With Ina the, Esco. Ina Esco. Nick. Knowledge Nick. Knowledge Nick. Uh, Focal, uh, Focal Walter. Was on that thing. Shout out to uh, Dr. Andre Johnson from Memphis Theological <coughs> Seminary. Dr. <coughs> Chuck. Uh, Charles McKinney from Rose College. Giovanni Dorcha, University yeah. of Memphis. Dr. Zandria Robinson, yeah. University of Memphis. Uh, Coach uh, William Anderson, Lamar yeah, College. Coach Jermaine Johnson from Mayor Rose High School. And uh, Jeremy, Jeremy McKinney yeah. from uh, Wood, not Woodell, uh, Woodell, Woodell, Kingsbury, Kingsbury, Kingsbury. Um, Look, Dr. It, Mark Nason. We've had, I mean, this whole Mark last Nason, yeah, uh, two, or, two or three. Uh, this last end of the first season, second season. Who else have we had? I don't want to forget anybody. We had the past and the professor. Don't get it twisted. Every day, all day, oh, once a week. Okay. Hard we, face. We say hype, uh, hype like yeah, the whole hype, hype life hype. artist. Uh, Look, here's what we're gonna do. So, right. so this whole thing was about this notion of tough love, as if the president has a platform. To have a relationship mm -hmm. with the people in such a way that mm -hmm. it can foster a climate of love and therefore change. So tell the people about how you are expressing your tough love in your community from the stuff going on with Black Thought, stuff going on at First Baptist and the rest of the life. We'll let everybody get your right. get your well, ears in. Man. Let me let me because this is the, let me say this this is my because we need to support this stuff. True. The stuff that you got going on, stuff that you got going on. Like I said, this brother needs to teach a uh, 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 research methods class. You know, so the way he know how. You, you know what I'm saying? And, and, and uh, we need to support. We need to, we need to support black media. We need to support black art. We need to support black. And quit art. thinking black, black folk gonna do this art for free because you gotta have money to compensate and finance your movement right. too. Now, That's right? Period. That's right. Need, we need some prophetic philanthropists. Good God. Prophetic philanthropists. Like, you know what? Oh. He, he, I, I gotta hang around. Him some more. He loved talking about some money. <laughs> now, money wait, coming. Wait, 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 I'm waiting wait, wait for him to say money coming to me. And then I'm going to walk up and I'm going to walk up and I'm going to I know I got jokes, but let me, let me go to what he asked me. First of all, let me say this. I think the weakness in where we are, we as in black people in this country concerning how to critique our president is finding some good vehicles in which to critique him. And, and I'll just say this, Cornel West and Tavis Smiley, although some of what they've said has great merit, mm -hmm. their vehicle and the ways in which they've gone about it have been faulty. And I think we have not found a way to critique him that sends two signals, sends the signal that even though for many of us he's a black symbol, and we may have questions as to whether he's a black leader, I ain't gonna get back into that whole piece. Mm -hmm. yeah, and even, though, you know. even though we have those questions, we're glad that you're there, but mm -hmm. we have these issues right. that we might want to have look that and you might need to address. We haven't figured out how to do that yet and I think some of that is a problem with us because when we see the symbol, we sometimes don't want to critique the symbol the way we've critiqued other presidents. Uh -huh. and, but you talked about the vehicle, so tell them. Yeah, one vehicle but now, black thought but now I'm going to get into that. I just want to do my wrap up okay. since I know my time will be passed after this by saying that. Now, <laughs> To get the black thought, one of the things, the 
that we try to do with black thought is to make us think from all angles about some of the issues that we have and also deal with some solutions. And so when I was looking at putting together a show, I said we have people in this town that access social media that have impact upon the conversations that happen in Memphis, everybody around this table. And so that's why two weeks ago we did this on Black Thought. Right. It was widely received. I've had people come up to me and say, I started watching you as a result of that show, mm -hmm. and I started listening to them mm -hmm. as a result of this show. So I hope... You know here I go with my hand out. Residual <laughs> check. You, you, you have some wonderful <laughs> puns. <man. laughs> but anyway... <laughs> I'm about to go down. Yeah. Yeah. Right, yeah. oh. I'm about to give us the time. But now, okay. MUTV1, Memphis's first black owned TV station. Support that. 10 a.m. every weekday. 10 a.m. Central every weekday. <clears throat> Comcast 31. Or if you don't have Comcast, you can go to MUTV1.com. It comes up on Ustream. And sooner or later, it will grow. So, and you can't us. bootleg it, you cheap Negroes. <laughs> you can't bootleg that, right? So your bootleg cable, it just ain't gonna pick that up. So get the real cable. Seventeen point six. If you have a, you know, digital antenna. Yeah. Thank you, man. Mm -hmm. Love that. So give us some. Give us. You got so much you work. Well, you know, I, I, yeah, you know, like I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna simplify it. But before I, you know, we talk about black, black leaders, Obama. Here you go. Since we're done. Okay, cool. And people always, <laughs> people always say, you know, <laughs> Barack Obama was the first black president of the Harvard Law Review, correct? Right. But who was the first black editor? Charles Hamilton Houston, the guy who was. Thurgood Marshall's mentor, and that's him. who okay. was the architect of Brown v. Board, who plan, tried man. to get law games from University of Missouri Law School back in the 30s. Now, that's a black leader. Who almost got lynched overseas in full uniform as an officer during World War I mm. by white, uh, white army soldiers. Whatever. Lamont on College, please hire him <laughs> but, <laughs> to teach research methods. We need this type of research method in, in the black community. Well, I, I remember that we all be group incorporated. We got our 501c3 approval last week after almost a year. You know, because you know what's going on. Right though, President Obama made the speech. They gave us this thick envelope in the mail. Saying, well, so well, I guess he's good. I guess he's more than a black symbol, I guess. I <laughs> so he's good for something. He's good for something. Trickle, I don't know. Trickle, trickle, <laughs> trickle down, down a little bit. But you go to weallbe.org. Basically, I can tell you, you can find information on our TV and radio. We got a TV channel on YouTube. But you go to weallbe.org to listen to our, our recent podcast. We did an interesting show with Dick Gregory last week talking about Brother Malcolm Shabazz. The recent scandals going on in the news and the media, but we are the media that we need to be. I That's mean, right. I'm just under the be this table. We need to start seeing ourselves through our own eyes, and this is the problem we have. And we got to reclaim the symbols. We got to reclaim our heritage. We got to reclaim the narrative. And now's the time. In the words of the great, or the play of the great immortal Charlie Parker, now's the time. So thank you. I seize the time. What's up, what's up, what's up? You know. Come on, Jack. Exactly, media. That's what we do. That's what I do. As Brother Ron said. You know, you got to start seeing these things and having this conversation through all eyes and through all media. Mm -hmm. um, you know, you have people running around all the time talking about we're going to take our country back, we're going to take our neighborhood back. Well, I just say give us all intellectual rights back. Mm -hmm. You know, be it jazz, blues, That's right. uh, what we're doing right now, the media, our self, our voices, and go back to our conversation, too. That's why this conversation was, I think, necessary and important on Barack Obama because that's an image right now. He has the most powerful microphones and speakers of all of that's us right. as, as black leaders or black symbols. Um, and, and when things happen to disapproval, we have to speak truth to power. You know, and I think a lot of us, our inability to speak, we become frozen because mm. a lot of us don't want to be caught on the wrong side of yeah. history. Mm. There was a lot of people, we talk about it often time, that was against Dr. Martin Luther King. Mm. Okay. Yeah. And we don't want to be caught on the back side of this one. Like, mm -hmm. oh, you didn't like Barack mm -hmm. when he was president. Don't try to go there and down. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but at the same time, you got to be truthful. And you got to say, you know, you got to mean what you say and say what you mean. Uh, you can find me right now at WRUG Media Group, WRUGmedia.com. Um, Live shows are coming back. It'll probably be in August. Mm -hmm. In August too. Black August. Uh, yeah, Black <laughs> August. Um, and and um, just support what we do, man. Look at it. we got things coming up. We we do a lot of party things too. We do a lot of you know it's it's not all this, um, but what I do want to do is bring 
black broadcasting back to the station. Um, and we were the first, you got a lot of internet music stations mm -hmm. going right now, but we were the first internet radio station in this nation, probably in the world, that played independent so, yeah. artists. Wow. We were the first one. And most of them do now, they play independent big artists, mm -hmm. but we would play most, I mean, unless you got real garbage. You know, we try to, we, we would play it most everything, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and we bring it, and we bring it back. Yeah, yes. and, 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 yes. and it is, and, and I, I was gonna, I was gonna say that too. We don't decide what's good and what's not good. What mm. I meant by garbage is sound quality and mm. things like that. We, we, we can't put <laughs> you up there crackling and sound like you got a, sound like you playing a, a 12 inch on a, mm. Mm -hmm. uh, components <laughs> in, you know. But anyway, <laughs> that's my feel. Look, look, thank y'all for y'all support of the pastor and the professor for the past two seasons. Yeah, yeah. So don't forget to find us on Facebook, the pastor <coughs> and the professor. Find us on Ustream, yep. the pastor and the professor. YouTube. Uh, find us on YouTube, the pastor and the professor. Find me uh, at pastor underscore Earl on Twitter. Find Abyssinian Missionary Baptist Church on Facebook and at ABC Ministries 2 on Twitter, www.abcministries1.org. Yep, Peace. like we said, as usual, in the words of Marcus Garvey. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Find me at Facebook, G double E, G E E, join on Facebook. Uh, Twitter too. G at G E E, join on Twitter. I'm hardly on there, so find me on Facebook. Rainbows and Lilacs dot blogspot dot com. That's my, uh, you know, I guess my little bully pulpit. Also, I want to shout out my father. One of the, uh, uh, the, the biggest inspiration of my life. He was on the show. I forgot to mention him. Yeah. Uh, and in the immortal words of Marcus Garvey, you can catch us. You can find us in the whirlwind. Like we always say, peace to the righteous. See you in August. Thank you, brother. I want to be on the show. Man. Yeah, like, wow. I really so much passion here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Let me go get some of this mud from Big Old Doc. I saw that. I saw that big truck here. Good. Good, good to see you too, man. No, no, you didn't. You didn't. You didn't see my truck. Yeah, I be checking y'all. I don't have, have a truck. Oh, well, I be well, checking well, all y'all stuff out, man. I look and I check everybody. That might be him. What's that? That truck? He's so big.